Welcome to Oman Radiology Gallery. I'm glad to see you all again. In today's video, we're going to explore something advanced but essential. How to generate high-quality 3D images of cochlea and semicircular canals using volume data. This is essentially important for cochlear implant candidates and for pre-surgical planning. Why is this so important? Because when we do cochlear implant planning, we need to know the exact course and demonstration of cochlea, the round window, oval window, and the relation of the facial nerves. The semicircular canals are equally important in balance disorders, congenital malformation, or cholesteatomy evaluation. 2D CT images may not give a complete view, that's why 3D reconstructions of high resolutional temporal bone CT has become a game changer, especially in implant patients. Now let's move to the operating console for post-processing. Toshiba Equilion CX Machine Console is used to generate advanced 3D images from DICOM data. It allows us to perform MPR, volumes rendering, and MIP reconstruction, especially useful for complex anatomy like the cochlea. The scan has been successfully completed and the scan volume is now available. We will proceed by reconstructing this volume using a defined region of interest, ROI. Let me guide you through the reconstruction process. First, click on raw data to access the directory from there. Select the relevant patient as demonstrated here. I've already selected the patient. Once selected, click on the OK button to proceed. You will now see the main interface. Locate and select the volume that has been acquired in the bone window setting. After selecting the appropriate bone window volume, click on the set ROI button to begin defining your region of interest. Adjust the ROI box so that it precisely encompasses the cochlea and the semicircular canals. Next, click on image selector to define the start position and then click it again to set the end position. Ensure that the slice thickness is set to the minimum value supported by the machine and similarly set the interval to the minimum as well. Once all the parameters have been configured, click the reconstruction button to initiate the process, just as I'm doing right now. Once the image is reconstructed, navigate to the 3D console and click on the 3D button. After doing so, you will see the directory option, click on it. From the directory, reselect the same patient as before. Then choose the volume that was previously reconstructed using the ROI. Click OK to continue. Allow the system a moment to load. Once the data is loaded, multiple options will be displayed and the interface will look as shown. Next, select the bone preset. Upon selecting it, a new interface will appear with several visualization tools. Choose the appropriate rendering option from the available list. The 3D rendering will now begin. As you can see, the cochlea is now clearly visualized. We will now proceed the clipping and segmentation to isolate and refine the anatomical structure for further analysis or presentation. Next, we will focus on further enhancing the 3D reconstruction. Any unnecessary anatomical structures outside the defined region of interest, ROI, including soft tissue, adjacent bonds, and other non-essential elements will be carefully removed. By utilizing the available tools and interface controls, we will refine and optimize the 3D model, ensuring a clean, detailed, and anatomical focused visualization suitable for precise analysis and high-quality presentation. Additionally, there are several advanced enhancements that can be applied to the 3D reconstruction to further improve visualization. For instance, the background, the background color can be customized to enhance visual contrast and clarity. The 3D model itself can be semi-transparent and various color schemes can be applied to highlight specific anatomical structures. Furthermore, the model can be rotated and viewed from multiple angles, enabling a more comprehensive and detailed examination of the anatomy. Next, we will perform a 360-degree horizontal rotation of the 3D model, allowing for a comprehensive view of the reconstruction from all sides. This rotation helps in assessing the quality, detail, and accuracy of the rendered anatomy. Following this model, will also be rotated vertically from the top to the bottom at a full 360 degrees. By rotating the model along both the horizontal and vertical axis, we achieve a complete multi-angle visualization enabling a throughout and detailed anatomical assessment. Thank you for watching this tutorial on 3D reconstruction of the cochlear region using the Toshiba Equilion CX CT scanner. I hope this step-by-step -step guide has helped you understand the process of acquiring, refining, and visualizing high-quality 3D images.
for cochlear implant assessments. If you found this video informative, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel for more radiology tutorials and advanced imaging techniques. This is Aman Radiology Gallery bringing you clarity through precision imaging. Until next time, take care and keep learning.